welcome back to our channel. So today let's discuss about multi language support in Odo 14 website community. So Odo helps you to go international. The Odo e-commerce comes with a language translation feature allowing us to translate languages automatically over the click. So one can easily edit the master page and Odo's on-demand professional translation service change the necessary part of the website for any language. So users from different regions can make use of this, this feature to translate website content to their regional language. Okay. Mm, so now well, let's go to website. And configuration settings. Okay, so here we can see a website, a default website is my website and here we can see the title and icon. Okay, so below that you can find option languages. So here we can add the languages that need to be available on your website. So here uh, one language is already added and from here we can select uh, more languages. So below you can see option to install new languages for your website. So you can click on this and install more languages or when you go to website there also you can find option to install add languages to your website. Okay, now let's go back to dashboard and go to website or you can directly go uh, from the settings to website. From here we can, if you want to change the website, you can change. Okay, so for your website here we can find a footer. So here you can find option to uh, translate language. So you can see there are two languages available. And if you wish to add new language, just click on add language. And here we can select the language. Suppose I want French. And I want this language available for all my website. So I'm in this option and clicking add. So after you add. And when you go to website. So here you can see that language is added. Then click on the language, translate the content of your website. Okay, now the, okay, you can see most of the content is translated. Okay, then here we can find an option to translate. So just click on that. So that shows something uh, like, um, most of the content is uh, content highlighted in yellow. So, uh, yellow represents the content that you have translated by yourself and green represents the content that has been already translated, that is automatically translated. Okay, so here you can find a uh, yellow color. So, if you wish to change it from here, you can change the content from here. can save or discard so that's all about multi-language support in Odo 14 community